What is going on fellow outlaws? Outlaw Gary here and in today's video we're doing the special edition bank heist. That's right. It's a bank heist that hasn't been shown much on YouTube and it's a Rhodes bank heist. Now for a lot of you guys that are going through your story you've done a bank heist in Valentine and later on in Saint Denis. But in this video we're showcasing a bank heist that many of you guys may have not done as it's only available in chapter four. Now I know if you have the special edition it sort of sucks because you may have not known about this and you're unable to do it once you pass chapter four. It's really sucky. I think the system's really weird. But regardless, today we're doing this bank guys. Of course, if you do enjoy the video, make sure you guys drop a like. Let's go for over 2,000 likes. And if you're new around here, hit that subscribe button as I'm really excited to go ahead and showcase to you this to you guys because it's gonna be fun. It's gonna be fun. I love bank heists. Charles, you busy? No, why? Fella sold me these plans. Oh, what do you gotta ask him for, Charles? Me? He's just gonna make a big drama out of it. You know he will. Drama out of what? <laughs> Only the easiest little bank score ever got taken. Well, I don't like robbing banks now. You like complaining and whining. We never robbed that bank in Rhodes. Arthur's good. He's the best man we got. And this is easy. But he complains a lot. <sighs> what is it? Turns out there's a big weakness in the building. They replaced a window to improve security, but the bricks are real weak. So? <laughs> the vault's right behind. The fellow sold me the plans, told me all about it. It's an open secret in town, due to be fixed any day, apparently. And we got enough explosives? I don't think so. Well, then, what are we waiting for? Come on. Well, just no wine in there, Arthur Morgan. Oh, shut up. I'll make you wine. Oh, give me this. So as you guys heard, the bank heist is taking place in Rhodes due to a faulty window that's weak. We've got some dynamite on our horses and some spools of uh, wire. And well, let's explode the bank, I guess. There's the bank, just there. I see it. Yeah, this way. Let's rest here till dark. This is my kind of bank robbery. It's time. Let's go. All right. I feel like that was a really weird place to sleep. Just like Wake up, with the plunger next Come to you and the sticks of dynamite. Not suspicious at all. I don't know how they didn't get caught, to be honest. So. All right. Let's see what's going on. That boy over there, he's a guard for sure. Uh, I'll go deal with that. Silently, please. Of course. First objective, take out the guard silently, as he said. You can go to use your throwing knife. One thing I realized with this mission is that you need to, it's a time sensitive mission. <gasps> Did he not die? He didn't die. Are you kidding me? Okay. If and when you do this, make sure you get a really good shot on him because clearly this guy can take a knife to the, to the brain and doesn't go down, so. These are not, what? All right, last chance at the knife throw. There we go. My God. Okay. Now that that's over with, okay. I want to let you guys know work, that this is a time sensitive bank heist. The moment you're in the bank, you only have a limited amount of time to take the money out. If you do not do it quick enough, you are unable to walk away with the max amount of money. Today, we're going to find out what that max amount of money is because I don't know. Unspool that wire to about 30 feet away. Sure. Thanks. This won't take long. How did they, who, like, who invented, like, this is so, look at this, this is crazy. Okay, I think we're all good. So smart. Ready when you are. 
All right, so I have to blow it up. Let's do it. I'm going in loud, dude. Here we go. We're going in. Of course, someone someone in the town heard that. Go, 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 go. Oh, I can't even. Hello? Look damaged. I reckon we should be able to pry them open. Right open. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's see what we got in here. <laughs> what the hell is that? We ain't got long. How much money is that? Ninety-six bucks. That's it. All right. How much is in this one? I hope way more than ninety-six bucks. That was like four hundred bucks. Maybe. Maybe more. Two hundred and forty bucks. Come on, come on. I hope his had a lot more money. Is that all of them? Yeah, that's all the money. Let's go, gentlemen. Quick. Come on. What was Let's that, go. 800 bucks? Let's get out of here. Follow me. How did they see me? Yeah. What? How? I had my mask on and I guess I was wearing clothes they recognized? Or my horse they recognized? I don't know, dude. That's a little suspicious. These guys got some eagle eyes. We should be able to escape the law, though. I have no idea how much money I just made. I think it was over 500 bucks, though. All right, I lost my cops. These dudes are just really slow. So the law is searching for us, but they're not gonna be able to find us. Let me know in the right. comment section, how much money did I just make? I have no clue. I was honestly hoping that because we have the special edition, because we have the special edition, that um, there would be like a large amount of money. But I think I, I think I made $400. I mean like $400, uh, I don't know. $400 is still a lot of money, but it's like, it was, it was more for the experience than the money, I guess. The money is very minuscule to the event itself. See? Easy. Real easy. How'd we do? We did okay, I think. Oh, and I have to split hey, it with the group? You, that was fun. Now, don't forget to give the camp a share, Uncle. Oh. As if I would. As if. Now, split up, both of you. Let's get moving. Oh, okay. Wait, what? How much was... Wait, what? Wait, how much money? What? Uh, what? All right. So let's let's go over this real quick. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I now have a bounty of $75 in this area. I made like, I maybe made 50 bucks. What? That is crazy. How little money we just made. Okay, that, that happened. So that aside, I do want to let you guys know there are other missions like this that you need to know about that only can take place during certain parts of the game and specific chapters. So let's go over that before you guys click away. If you guys have enjoyed the video so far, make sure you guys drop a like because there are missions like this you can do, but only at certain times in the game. So let's go over those real quick. You have chapter two, chapter three, and chapter four. Now the chapter two robbery that Javier gives you is a home robbery, but is available in chapter three when you move to Clemens Point from Horseshoe Overlook Camp. But if at any point you leave chapter three or chapter four without doing any of these activities or robberies, easy ways to make money, you will not be able to do them in chapter five. So chapter three, you can do a Javier home robbery, a Sean coach robbery, a Bill coach robbery, and then a home robbery with Sean again. Chapter four, you have the bank robbery I just did, but it's exclusive to the special and ultimate edition of the game. You have Micah's coach robbery and then Lena's, uh, Lenny's coach robbery. Again, these are only available in these chapters. So if you're on chapter five, chapter six, or have beat the game, you cannot do these, including the special and ultimate edition version of, these, of the game, which is so dumb to me because I think a lot of you guys spent a lot of money uh, to, to have these in-game exclusives. And at some point in the game, you can no longer do them. It's so weird to me. You should always be able to do uh, the robbery that's available for special and ultimate edition uh, versions. But hey, 
I didn't create the game. If you guys, of course, have enjoyed this video, make sure you drop a like. I, I'm glad I was able to share this Rhodes experience with you guys because I don't think many people have showcased it on YouTube. It's been super fun and uh, not really worth the time, but it was more just this is a bank robbery and not many people are showcasing it on YouTube. So I wanted to get up to you guys to see it. And uh, thank you guys so much for all the support. We've been growing at 4,000 subscribers a day, which is crazy, and over 500,000 views a day. So big thanks to all of you guys that are new. If you enjoyed this, show the love, and I'll see you guys uh, later on today with a brand new video, all right? Bye, guys.